With the embargo being lifted for NBA 2K24, we got to see a lot of the curators that dropped their my player builds that had went to Community Day. Now, out of all of the builds that I seen, it was only one build that really caught my eye, and it was the 66 ISO guard build that I seen Double H made. So let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, so if we looking on the screen here, like out of all of the videos I seen yesterday, this is probably one of the better builds that I seen. Like I seen a lot of creators they made six ones. They wasn't really hitting on that. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I seen a six eight. I seen a six eight build that was solid. I seen a couple block builds that I seen was solid. But far as like six six, you know what I'm saying? I feel like six six would be the meta. I don't know if it will be. We never know because you know the game ain't out yet and we haven't played it. So I don't know. But looking at it, bro, it really feel like I don't know. I mean a 90 driving dunk, a 78 three now. For me, I really want to have a 78 three. I'll probably put my driving dunk down to like an 84, 85 put my ball handle down to like an 85 that way i can you know upgrade my shooting at least you know what i'm saying especially if you go to the elite and you get that permanent shooting boost now we don't even know what the shooting boost is yet like how much it's gonna boost your three-point shot but yeah that's what i would do but other than that bro three-point shot is good you remember i think i think mike wayne said that shooting with a low three ball this year is gonna take skill or it was gonna be like consistent if you know how to shoot so that 73 ball is not that bad. Like I said, 92 ball handle. I probably wouldn't go that high, but 87 perimeter, 85 still. 68 block. You see the speed, you see the acceleration, you see the vertical, you see the 95 stamina. I mean, it was like a solid 66 build all around to me. You know what I'm saying? So hold on, let me see. Let's see what Double H was talking about. Let's see what he got, you know, the badges wise. Anyways, let's act like we did that. We got gold handles for days. Uh, you get gold hyper drive, you get gold challenger, you get gold ankle breaker, you get gold off ball pass. All right, so we looking at this. You get silver open looks. What's that? Aerial Wizard Gold. You get silver clamps. That's good. I don't see. Do he even get 94 feet? I don't even think he get that. Is that that badge right there? Bro, let me go back. All right, so this is the 92 ball handle. Let me see. What badge? Oh, that's Speed Booster right there. So yeah, he get gold Speed Booster. That's it. That's good. And I think that's gold unpluckable right there with a 92 ball handle. So he's good with that unpluckable. Uh, hold on. Let me go look at a 94 feet badge. Hold on. All right. So for the 94 feet badge, you need a 88 perimeter, 95 stamina. But let me go see if he got that. What you need? You need an 88 perimeter. He got 87. He got the 95 stamina. So right now, looking at his build, he'll have 94 feet on silver, which is good. Because to get it on gold, all you need is 88 perimeter, which, which he doesn't have. He's one. See, that's why I said I'll probably lower my driving dunk and I'll probably lower my ball handle a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just so I can get that that one attribute on perimeter defense, just so I have an 88, so I can get that 94 feet on gold. Because all you need is 84 perimeter defense and 95 stamina, which he got. Now I gotta go check if he got fast feet. What's his fast feet on? I don't even know what the badge look like. Hold on. So if y'all can see at the bottom right here with fast feet, you need a 92 perimeter. To get it on silver, you need an 87, I mean, an 83 perimeter and a 73 acceleration. So he has an 87 perimeter, which is good. So he'll be able to get fast feet on silver. And if he adjusts, you know, his attributes, he'll be able to get 94 feet on gold. So 94 feet gold, he'll have fast feet on silver, which I feel like would be solid anyway. Clamps, which you need an 84 perimeter defense. So he'll have silver clamps too. So yeah, so if he adjusted his badges, his last attributes, he'll have he will have silver clamps, gold 94 feet, and silver fast feet. So yeah, like I said, bro, this is a solid build, bro. Like I said, I'll probably tweak some attributes, you know, if I was making a 6'6 build, but I don't like I said, bro, this is probably one of the better builds that I've seen out of all of the creators that you know drop. Joe knows has some good builds too, of course. You know, Joe knows gonna look out, but I don't know. Them other builds, they kind of rattled me a little bit. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. You get gold hyper drive, you get gold challenger, you get gold ankle breaker, you get gold off ball pass, gold slivery off ball, gold pro touch, gold aerial wizard, gold unpluckable, gold speed booster. You get a lot of good badges here. You know, the same shooting badges, the same finishing badges as the 6 8. The only difference here is we just get better playmaking badges, way more animations with the drill moves because we have a 92 ball handle now. So we're going to get all those drool moves that we get at 90 plus ball handle 88 ball handle and stuff like that our drool moves in general are probably just gonna be faster because we have an 87 acceleration on this build now the speed is basically the same 82 speed yeah it, it's really just trading off the interior defense and the blocking for a faster build and more drill move unlocks that's really just all what right, you so have to decide solid. now 
I ain't gonna lie, huh? Let me go back and look at it again. Only thing I got a problem with, and y'all, I said plenty of times by now, is the shooting. Because, you know, I like fading. I'm gonna be honest. I really like, oh, he do get 94 feet. Man, I had to go read that. I could just look at it right there. I didn't even, I wasn't even looking at that side of the screen. But anyway, shooting wise, I don't know. Fading, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we, we don't know how good fading gonna be this year because y'all know the past two years, fading has been to we, we ain't got to talk about it y'all know what fading been but yeah it, it's kind of crazy but hold on i think somebody else made a 6-6 six, six. all right so this is grinding's build you know what i'm saying simply grinding this is his but god dang did you and uh did you and double h made the same build let me find out y'all sitting beside each other or something but nah i'm chilling so they build kind of similar only thing is you know similar driving dunk similar playmaking similar defense he got two attributes higher. He got an 83 and double H got a 78. So that's kind of solid. You know, his physical is still solid, but that strength, I don't know. You're going to need that strength to get that. Uh, Hold on. Let me see. Yeah, to get clamps. Yeah, that strength definitely going to be important. You know, just to get clamps. Yeah, 44 strength. I don't know. But like I said, I'll tweak a few things. But let me see what he got to say. Say there it is. Not only is your speed and your acceleration substantially faster than a six foot seven or six foot eight, you also unlock gold speed booster. Not to mention with a 92 ball handling, you also unintentionally unlock gold blow by gold handles for days, which by the way, spoiler alert, six foot eights get silver handle for days, gold unpluckable, gold ankle breaker, which I think is gonna be extremely fun, just cooking up on a six six and getting ankle breakers, and a higher overall three point rating. Now, if we look at this build, you can probably already see some mistakes by some of the information that I told you. First of all, it's time we talk about driving dunk. Now, in the intro, I told y'all that to get contact dunks, you need an 89 driving dunk and a 78 vertical. Not because it's what unlocks posterizer, because you already have posterizer on silver, but because that is the lowest absolute requirements you need for contact dunk animations according to the community day forms they gave us. Now, they. I ain't gonna lie. I like how the builder is, bro. You need a high driver dunk to get contact dunks to where you want. You need a high three ball to get. You need a 923 just to get silver limits range. That tells you all about the builder right there. And then you, they fact the physical factors in too. Like, bro, I, oh my, bro, I'm ready to play this game, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I did say those are subject to change, so if they do change, I will let y'all know, but for right now, that's what it is. Now, what I didn't tell you is that if you spend one extra point on driving dunk, you get gold precision dunker. You see that T-Ray badge right there that's sitting at silver? One more point on driving dunk, and that turns to gold. And what that badge does is substantially increases your green window percentage on dunk meter dunks. Now, I know y'all are smart, right? One extra point for a gold badge that's gonna increase your green window percentage on something where all gonna be doing that just sounds worth it right that's because it is so i ain't gonna lie i don't seen all i need to see i will tell y'all this though i was talking to my dog you know what i'm saying wavy you know if y'all don't know who wavy is man he had another content creator i think he got like 80k subs that's my dog i was talking to him earlier he was like i he went like I, I had told him that you're not gonna be able to max out every one max out in every category like last year you know what i'm saying because the builder is balanced which i like it, it's kind of like like uncle didn't be saying been saying the whole time you know if you want to go 99 and one at, uh in one category you're not going to be able to get anything else barely you know what i'm saying you're not gonna be able to get the high cigs high dribbling uh high dunking high shooting high defense you're not gonna be able to get all that it's either one or it's either one or two categories you're gonna max out in and the other two gonna be you know and plus you gotta factor in the physicals bro I'll, dang well how many days we got five days four days i got bro i ain't gonna lie hey man it's your boy dj man i'm gonna catch y'all next video man and i'm out